So, um, first one is denaturing of protein via cooking. Good, bad, or benign? This is fun because we get to talk about how proteins actually work. So proteins are made specifically in the human body by they basically amino acids get joined together in your ribosomes, right? In your, from your messenger RNA and your tRNA. And then those proteins get folded into loopy loops and helices and sheets and all sorts of stuff. And that 3D structure is what gives protein its entire function. Like if there's no folding, it doesn't do anything. It's basically just a sheet of amino acids. And so like, that's why some proteins make you sick. That's why some proteins function like insulin. That's why some proteins do certain things and others, it's their shape. It's how they're folded is their shape. When you denature it, you are, when those proteins get folded, they have to stay folded like this by bonding between these, these pieces. And so when you denature it, you basically just undo all those bonds and the protein just unfolds itself. So all you're doing when you denature a protein is you're reducing its biological activity and you are making it easier to easier. enzymatically yeah. digest because it's not yeah. folded so enzymes can get in there. So that's really all you're doing. But this is why when you cook protein, this is why you can eat cooked protein but you can't eat uncooked protein besides the bacteria and stuff like that, obviously. But that's the, that's why you cook it. Is it that heat denatures the proteins? And so you can consume right. it without getting sick because there's no more biological activity. This is also why you can eat protein that's been cooked in acid, like ceviche, which has the, the citric yeah, acid yeah, it, in it. it yep. That denatures mm -hmm. the protein. Yeah. You can actually watch protein denature when you cook an egg. So when you put an egg on a pan, the clear white, that's all protein, it's albumin. That albumin gets denatured, so it goes opaque. Same thing when you like squeeze lime juice on a shrimp, you see it go from clear to pink because it it denatures. So you can actually watch that process. It doesn't reduce the biological value of it. It's not bad. Like That's just how proteins transform when they undergo heat or exposure to acid.